campaign trail I said I was for too long. The American people have today marks a new day. For Something what I on the campaign trail I on the campaign. I know there has been a lot of questions regarding my relationship. Today marks a new day for today marks a new today marks a new day for our country. Today we set our course in a brave direction that will not only revitalize our Who needs a hero? Check it with my mum. Whoa. Take the bell, you earned it. That's what I like to see. You can go, mate. Get the little bucket. Nothing unusual about this. Bring it down the house. Here comes the talent. This is a prop. It's not a problem. You alienated part of America. I alienated crazy people. You couldn't resist, could you? Jesus, not you two. This is a problem. I keep trying to explain that, but the president won't listen. Poverty is a problem. Apartheid is a problem. This, this is just a couple of... Here's the latest approval ball. We lost 20 points. We can get it back. They're at 20 points. I'll admit that's a little lower than anticipated. So you agree you have a problem? No, you do. You're the communications director. Fix this. Can you give me 100% employment? No. Will you get married? Oh, no. Then I'll think you're in trouble. King, can the others not say assassinated? Not when you say it publicly. You want fun as a gang leader? We have a country to run. Fun isn't part of the equation. Where's a septic truck when you need one? for me. I'm really not looking forward to question time. Listen, we've got enough clout right now for one major bill, not both. What do you want me to push forward? Do you want to be the president who cured cancer or the president who solved world hunger?
Speaking of hunger, you fancy a steak and kidney pie? Good choice. Hopkins has got the press under control. Now, you listen here. If you think you can cram your agenda past Congress, you are in for a rude awakening. You hear me? Now, let me tell you a little something about the greatest word in politics. Filibuster. Allow me to retort. Oi, Doris, we're still on for tennis, yes? Oleg and I are about to head over to Camp David to watch some Nightblade. Yep. You down? Boom! Hell yeah, I'm in. I'm your number one fan! <laughs> nice work, Oleg. words were taken out of context. Kinsey, what's the right context for, and I quote, I'm the patron saint of America. We should probably look into changing the Pledge of Allegiance to one nation under me. That's a great question. Jane? I think we have a problem. Oh, not you two. How many times do I have Asha to... and Miller are waiting for you in the Oval Office. If MI6 needed something, they would send it up the chain, not fly across an ocean. They said nobody back home believes them. Jesus, what's going on? They think we're about to be attacked by aliens. I gotta go. This is serious. You know that Kinsey's been saying the same thing. When did you start taking Kinsey seriously? When the people who helped us save the world said we should. All right. I'll swing by after I... <laughs> Not a time for fear, but a time for celebration. Today, the best and brightest among you will find salvation within the Zin Empire. I'm smarter than all these people. Delightful. Kitty, no! Protect the president! I do love your spirit, my dear. I'm Zinyak. Pleasure to meet you. Would you like to join me for a ride? God, you're all right. You all right? Where's Matt? Upstairs, trying to find out what's happening. What is happening? All out war, by the looks of it. I'm meeting up with Matt. I'll be in touch via comm. Stay safe. Come on, this way! What the fuck, Kate? Right. 
nothing! You ETs are so fucking dead! Tell my wife! I had enough one! I regret nothing! Piss off, you ugly shots! Tell my wife! I had another one! You burks picked a fight with the wrong poses! Find that ugly mother. These enemies see they're coming, eh? Invader. Where are you, asshole? Oh, my cabinet. I'll rip your fucking head off. Shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Matt, hold on to me! Oh your man! God damn it! Enjoy leaping so much. Get off my lawn, you son of a bitch! Didn't count on me, did you? Well, hello there. Welcome aboard. I'm gonna melt you over the fireplace, you idiot fuck! Now, now, not so fast. Did you really think you could stop me? 
Fucking hell! Oh, human arrogance. Is there anything more charming? Fucking lost! Oh, I'm gonna... Do what exactly? Huh? Bravado me to death? <laughs> I'm going to have fun breaking you. Smells scrumptious. Holy oh, to the Saints! Brought to you by Friendly Fryer, the only Joyce in home goodware. Morning, dear. I made your favorite breakfast. Mr. King from across the street is going out of town for a few weeks. He was wondering if you could check his mail for him. Oh, and your friend Pierce called. I'm sure he has some crazy new get-rich scheme. Oh, that Pierce. Such a card. And someone named Dex stopped by earlier. I didn't recognize him, so I just sent him away. I think I heard Timmy deliver the paper earlier. Could you fetch it, dear? Right away, dear. I did only I, neighbor. I wonder what is going on in the world today. <laughs> you ready to meet the fine people of Steelport? Well, <laughs> get in the car. Don't I usually drive? It's your world. Go ahead. Boy, they sure are anxious to meet you. And by they, you mean? <laughs> well, you do have a queer sense of humor. Why does this all look so bizarre? Now, what's that you say? Something's not right. This is so... <laughs> Can't wait to get out to the lake this weekend. I hear the fish are really biting. The fish? What are you talking about? Don't you worry now. We're almost there. Careful now. Well, here we are. Why don't you glad hand a bit? We got time. Ow, my toe. <laughs> Can I get a picture? Kindly. Looks like it's time. Your public is waiting. Oh, my stars, it's the president. Hi, how are what a... we don't use that kind of language here in Steelport. What the fucking 
this is f cut. <laughs> I'll just be getting the fucking out of here. Hello? Hello? Kizzy, is that really you? Oh, finally! Listen to me. No time to explain, but you have to break free. What am I meant to break free from? The place you're in isn't real. Whatever it's having you do, you need to stop. But I'm driving a car. Okay, good. There's a park nearby. Head there and give me a sec. Brace yourself. Brace me. Good God! I need some more time before I can get you out. It'd be really helpful if you could just, you know, just be you. Who else would I be? The simulation is all about normalcy, pleasantry, or all the things you hate. Go forth. Unleash hell. Right, I'm better than you. Right, line up for a whooping. Come on, give me some support. You need to do more. Bigger. Hold on, I'm sending you something. Sure is Nita. Is... Oh no. Wait a minute. What am I waiting for, Kinsey? What's wrong? Oh, that's salty. 
you know? Couldn't leave well enough alone, could you? You had to push and push and push. I hope you've enjoyed your last moments. What's next? Prison of Peace would never hold a sociopath like yourself. Or more of a puckish rogue. A rose by any other name. Are you trying to kill me or sleep with me? Charming. See, there you go with those mixed messages again. Then allow me to be perfectly clear. I am the architect of your reality. I build what I want. I destroy what I want. And your bravado means... Fighting back is pointless, my friend. There's nowhere to run. You belong to me. Now, on to more pleasant things. I'm going to place you in your new home. Try to run again, and I'll destroy your pitiful planet. Did you ever? Each of you are guilty of crimes against the Zin Empire. But today is your lucky day. Today, you get to be a part of a new work release program. Swear your fealty, and I will empower you to be Wardens of Simulation 31. You will have one purpose. Torment the President of the United States. Beyond that, the world is yours to toy with. Ravage it. Indulge in your basest desire. It makes no difference to me. Uh, just leave the prisoner alive. I want them broken. Not dead. Go now and tear their world asunder. Yes, love. But well, how, since I don't have a mobile with me? I just patched myself into your simulation and projected my voice through the audio system. You should be able to hear me from anywhere. And you don't have to yell. Right, because I love voices in my head. Kinsey, I'm on arm to you. Kindly show me the exit. I can't do that until I backtrace your signal to your physical body. Until then, you're stuck there, so you might want to go buy a gun. Brilliant. So I'm up to friendly fire. I 
cool where the nearest one is. <sighs> Set your GPS from the map in your hub. Hub? It's like a digital information pad. You know, like those mobile devices all the kids have these days? Nice. Can it send Zinyak a snapshot of my ass? No. You are getting me out of here, right? Eventually. I'm still trying to figure out the Zin systems. Basic hacks like hooking into the audio system isn't hard. Trying to disconnect you and find your body, that's a bit more involved. And shedding these ridiculous clothes isn't a basic hack. On my list of priorities, that doesn't even make my top 500. If you had to wear this, you'd sing a different tune. If I was wearing that, I'd be asking you to shoot me in the head. Is that glowing dome something important? Hmm, not sure. I'll have to look into that. Zinyak soldiers are everywhere. From what I can see, a lot's been taken over by the Zin. There's alien technology everywhere! Do you think it's the dog's bollocks? Just a little. Do you expect the entire White House was demolished? I don't know. Maybe. Why? I just thought we should rebuild it as the ultimate crib. Steel walls, surface to air missiles, swimming pool with a bar you can swim up to. <laughs> Are you serious? And more stripper poles in the bedrooms to boot. More? You already had some stripper poles? You say that like so bad thing. <sighs> wow. Seems a bit risky, me at a gun store. You sure they'll sell to me? I don't know. Do you remember how to shop for yourself, or did being president make you too good for that? useful, because the cops are swarming your location. I have a second amendment right. Zinyak's running this place. I don't think the Constitution holds any weight here. That's right, line up for a whooping. What next? You expect me to lie low till you find a way to free me? Not yet. There's a Zim patrol close to you that'll need to be cleared out before that happens. That is, if the President's up for killing a few more aliens. Capital idea, Madam Press Secretary. What can I say? I'm good at my job. Thanks to your warm personality. True.
Oi, you blokes looking for me? Just kill them and leave already. Fucking sight. Okay, it's time to get off the street. Use my warehouse. It's not far. Well, I wouldn't want to impose at all. What's wrong with my inner sanctum? Did I say there was anything wrong? There's nothing here, Kinsey. What? Damn it! Zinyak removed all signs of the Saints from the simulation. That means... This city isn't gonna cut me any breaks. Right. So what am I meant to do about it? Hmm. Not sure yet. Though any hope you can give with gathering information on systems in the simulation would be useful. I'll leave any tasks I have for you in the quest section of your hub. Right. I feel better already. Just hang in there. I promise I'll find a way to get you out. Just try to be quick about it.
Clusters seem to be loose bits of code left behind by the simulation for some reason. I've only been able to locate a small amount right now, which I'm having trouble locking onto. Once in the general area of a cluster, I should be able to direct you to its location. Once again, Kinsey, I know fuck all about what you've got me doing or why I'm doing it. I'm still trying to figure out precisely what they are, but they seem like they'll be useful. There are several near my warehouse. I can't pinpoint their exact locations, but I marked the general areas for you. Watch your proximity meter to see if you're getting closer to the cluster, or farther away. How safe is it to nick this thing? Safe... ish. Just keep getting them. But when we get to Oh, yeah, this song is brilliant. They sing with me, Kitty. No, I don't think so. Oh, this is happening, even if I have to let you be the cat. Not gonna happen. We come together. <laughs> You're up, Kenji, and you know it ain't fiction. No. That is a direct order, Miss Kensington. Fuck that. You wonder why I don't have you to tea anymore. How'd that work out for you? Details, Kinsey, and try to keep them simple. It seems that anything that broke the normal rules of the simulation deposited loose data that can be incorporated into your programming. It's truth. I think I actually understood that. But since the data is so fragmented, it doesn't leave behind a complete subroutine to loop into your code base. And uh, back to the gibberish. Ugh, it's simple. The more clusters you get, the more you can upgrade and alter your abilities. And Bob's your uncle. So far. Still missing some key fragments. Get one more and we'll see. So, are these data biscuits? Uh, clusters. Right, clusters. If they can be so bloody useful, why does Zinyak leave them lying around? Why would they need them? To give his soldiers more juice? I don't know, you said they're so amazing. If Zinyak wants to change the code for his people, he can just... He wrote the simulation! But doesn't he want us to keep... Uh, sorry, I'll just accept this and move on. Probably better that way.
That's right, I'm a fucking saint. Holy shit. Zinyak destroyed my flat. Ugh. That place should have been condemned a long time ago. Well, the ladies never complained. That should be enough. Let's see what I can do here. Check your hub. Let me load up a training program for you to test your powers. So, what's this then? The code says you can jump long distances and run at super high speeds. How about starting with a small jump? Okay, try focusing on charging your jump. That should get you higher. How exactly am I supposed to jump up that? Try pushing off from the wall each jump. So I just run up walls now, do I? It'd be more accurate to say you can jump up them repeatedly. Pretty much the same thing. This time I blew the buildings apart. Try making that jump. Oh, I'm liking this. Okay, now for the big test. Use your super speed to get a running start and leap to that opposite building. You gotta be fucking joking. Just try it. Fun, but we could do better. Good, because I found a race subroutine already in the city. Spot on. I think I figured out how this works. Run along the path collecting the power orbs, which should boost your new speed. Every time you hit a checkpoint, you'll be able to stay in the program a bit longer so you can reach the end. Though you probably want to avoid the firewalls along the way. Good luck. How's this race tied to the simulation? Don't know, but it seems like when you break through any checkpoints along the race, the district's reality matrix will overload a little. You lost me. It means the simulation doesn't like it, and we're able to control the area. Hey, that time it made sense. It did the first time I said it too. Love you too, Kitty. Lies.
How's this race tied to the simulation? I don't know, but it seems like when you break through any checkpoints along the race, the district's reality matrix will overload a little. You lost me. It means the simulation doesn't like it, and we're able to control the area. Hey, that time it made sense. It did the first time I said it too. Love you too, Kinsey. Lies. 